This is Las Vegas Vantage with your host, Rocky Dickerson. Hi, welcome to Las Vegas Vantage. I'm Rocky Dickerson with Realty One Group. Now here on Las Vegas Vantage, we do cover a little bit about the real estate in Las Vegas. And we also cover the community, the great people that make this such a wonderful place to live. Now today we're covering an unusual aspect of real estate. We're covering assistance. Now many people aren't aware of what assistance are, so we're gonna cover that today. And we're gonna do so with an assistant of one of my absolute favorite agents in the world, Debbie Maxwell. Today, we've got with us Christina Kelman. Christina, thanks for being with us today. Hey, thanks for having me. Now, Christina, as I understand, you've been around the real estate business about 10 years. Is that right? That's right. Okay. And you started as an agent? I did start as an agent. Um, I got my license about 10 years ago working with Debbie. Um, and realized that once I started a family and stuff like that, um, I really enjoyed kind of taking that backseat role, um, doing all the things behind the scenes that allows Debbie to be out there and shine and do all of the great marketing and negotiations that she does. So, um, so yeah, it's been about probably about eight years of being an assistant. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Well, a lot of people aren't quite aware of how the real estate industry has has changed over the years. Like for instance, when my dad was selling properties back in the 70s, he sometimes would would write a contract in the back of a placement. Things are obviously much more complicated now. And so you help with making sure all the paperwork is processed. Is that right? That's right. I mean, that's the bulk of what I do is um, keeping all of our documents organized, which is, a you know, it's a major thing. We, I'm sure in Nevada, it's probably the same, but in North Carolina, there's a ton of forms to keep track of. Um, there's various systems that I know vary by uh, realty to realty, but we have, you know, systems of file saving that we have to learn and do. Um, and so a bulk of what I do is that writing listing agreements, writing offers to purchase, um, keeping all of our client documents in one place, all of those things. And it it takes up a lot of time. And so that's the value of having an assistant is that I can do all of that. And then you don't have to. (laughs) Sure, exactly. Now, I actually had uh, a mentor back in the 80s that was uh, teaching me how to utilize an assistant. And back then, we actually used to get some pushback from our clients because the client would wonder why they weren't hearing from the agent themselves at times. So what do you do to let the client know that you're a part of the team? So we usually right from the get go, send out an introduction email that explains who I am, how closely Debbie and I work together, um, which is nice because they know me my name. If I shoot them a text or an email, they, they're not like, who is this person? Um, and then also too down the road, one of the most valuable pieces is when we keep in touch with these clients, they know who I am. When I send out an invitation to a party, they know who I am and they know that we work closely together. So it's actually nice in that aspect too. And when we go back and maintain relationships, you know, I send out anniversary cards and stuff like that. Um, I know who these people are. I remember them from five years ago. And I know that, you know, when they call and say, Hey, we're thinking about buying another house. It's, it's, it's nice to know who they are, where they've come from, you know, watching them move up in the world. It's kind of nice. Sure, sure. Now, the way my mentor explained it to me back in the 80s, it sounds a little bit similar to what you do. And the fact that he would explain his assistants sort of like the staff in a doctor's office. They make sure the patient's taken care of, checked in, and then the doctor comes in and sees what's wrong and makes the prescription to get everything right. And it sounds like you're doing the same, basically helping the client along so that Debbie can come in, find out what needs to be done and take care of it. Would that be about the way you'd say? That's right. And I mean, just the same way as a doctor, um, she, you know, where she shines is really negotiations and marketing and client relationships. And that's what she needs to focus on doing and spend her time doing. Um, so that's where I come in. I do all the stuff that she doesn't need to be doing. So she has time to do the stuff that she's good at. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. So what do you enjoy the most about being an assistant? I, so I'm by nature, a really organized person. So I actually enjoy 
filing and maintaining our database and doing the little like nitty gritty stuff like that. <laughs> um, but, I, but beyond that, I, I do enjoy the relationships too. Um, we do a few um, client appreciation parties throughout the year and it's nice to put faces to names and it's just kind of like a big family. And so I enjoy kind of keeping that all together. Well, fantastic. So um, always when we're here on Las Vegas Vantage, yes, we do like to talk about business and professionalism, but we also like to talk a little bit about the, the community here in Las Vegas. And I understand you had one trip to Las Vegas so far, but it one was trip. quite memorable. It was, it was. Uh, so the reason I went wasn't the greatest. I had a long ago failed engagement we called everything off but both of us decided to do our separate trips our bachelor and bachelorette trips so mine was to vegas so a bunch of my girlfriends and i flew out there our plane actually got struck by lightning on the way <laughs> we had a whirlwind weekend um some of it's a little hazy <laughs> but uh but all in all i think we had a good time and that was my my one and only trip to vegas but Hopefully someday I'll get to come back and remember more of it. <laughs> well, there you go. I understand Debbie's coming out soon. So maybe you'll uh, pop yeah. out with her sometime. Ooh, we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> and speaking of Debbie, uh, obviously, whenever I have someone moving out to the Charlotte area, Debbie is the one agent on my list I would send them to. Uh, if someone is tuning into here and they're thinking about moving out to Charlotte, how can they reach your team? Sure. Um, you can reach us. Uh, our main email address, it's easy to remember, info at the Um, We're with Remax Executive in Charlotte, North Carolina. Charlotte is booming. It's a fantastic place to live. It's a great place to raise a family. Um, I would highly recommend it. I'm born and raised here too, so I haven't left. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, so that is our email. Um, Debbie's phone number is 704-491-3310. You can text, you can call. Well, great. Well, Christina, I thank you so much for being on the program with us here today. Thank you so much for having me. I enjoyed it. And we thank all of you for watching Las Vegas Vantage today. As always, if you're looking to sell or buy real estate here in Las Vegas, I would love to give you superior service. Give me a call, Rocky Dickerson at 702 743 7625. Email rocky at rockysellsvegas.com and please subscribe to my video channel.